Hello everybody and welcome back to RimWorld, where we are kind of struggling a bit. Because uh, we don't have much food. And we've got a psychic drone. And people are not happy. And Renard has just gone berserk. Fantastic. So I think we knocked Renard out. And he's now in bed sleeping. But we are just basically, I think, going to seal up the base and try and wait until there's some food around. Do you know what, though? There's a meal there. Someone will go haul that in, like, seriously. Go on. Oh, no, hang on. Who's starving? Renard. So, if I... Just tell the Tumnix to... Right, let's lift the restrictions. And I'll tell the Tumnix to go and haul that simple meal in. I'll tell Ed to prioritise working on the wall. Atini, why are you unhappy? We're just starving, right? Not much I can do about that, unless there's any other meals or meat or anything like that on the map. There's steel. Can't eat that. There are boom rats. There are things we can maybe hunt. Squirrels. Oh. Right. Metasapia. You have the sniper rifle. You are the hunter. The huntress. Go and hunt. Go and hunt, my huntress. And snipe all of those for us. Um, I want to get the starvation under control. Once I have the starvation under control, we can get the psychic drone under control. Starvation is minus 25 to mood. Psychic drone is minus 25 to mood. At its highest. So at the moment... At the moment... I mean, Metasapia doesn't get affected by it, but uh, it's medium. So it's minus 6. Oh, Ed is clearly not very sensitive either. Um, but the people who are normally sensitive to it, looks like it. it's minus 15 at the moment. So starvation and urgent hunger is much worse. Okay. Red Sapia. Go and snipe some of these guys. You're not a very good shot, are you? Maybe I'll improve. I know they're in cover, but can't you hit one? Would being closer help? Really, I just need you to like kill one of these guys. Really? Even a misfire. That would be great. There's tons of them. There. One's down. Right. Sapia, please. I'll undraft you. Um... No, actually, no. I'll keep you drafted. Keep you firing at stuff. And we'll get someone else to come out and just haul that. So. Oh. So you should be able to. Yeah, perfect. Just don't walk in Metasapia's firing line, whatever you do. I 
Kid's on his way. So we're not being treated. Yeah, okay. Killing these guys, hunting these guys is our main. Gonna be our main food source for a while. Ed, really? You're like the slowest person in the world. Meta will have actually killed another one by the time you actually get up there to haul it. It will have rotted away. Right, now, Ed. We want you to be a bit careful now. Just go maybe like over here. Right, and then I'll undraft you. You can hold the buck. And then go home. Right, Metasapia. Fire at that book. While well, it's asleep. Sleeping targets, yeah? Should be easy, right? Yes, it is easy. I do feel a bit mean. Hoping that this is producing food. We'll just check that that buck has gone to the freezer. Oh, Ed's still carrying it. Okay. The Tamnix is on the way out. to get that one. What's the shooting like now? Still 13. It's a master shooter. Oh, Buck is angry. And awake. Ed's back in bed, so that would mean that there's a buck there. Twelve days before that. Yeah, that's cool. Good, 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 good. Visitors from Arts Ridge. That would have been an excellent time to have uh, had the scythers out. Because sometimes the visitors will go and attack the enemy. Metasapia, I think you need to move a bit so that you're actually a bit closer. Right, now fire at that buck again. I need it dead so that we can eat it. I want all of these in the freezer. Okay, cool. Next. Next. Go on, Madisipia. Right. 
I need people to come and haul. Um, they're not forbidden anymore. I don't know, it's all you drafted, okay. Haul that, Ed. Come and haul that one. Um, who else can walk relatively quickly? Tony's not too bad. Haul that one. Meta can take one back with her, and then that just leaves one. I feel kind of mean. Meta, just like fire at this one, seriously. I know you've been hunting all night and you're a bit tired, but that one will be easier. It's not wandering around. How much have we got in the freezer now? Has anyone bothered to butcher them yet? There's just two big deers in there. That's okay. Deers? Deer. <laughs> and another dead one? Not quite. I think it was hit. Healthy in pain. Please don't walk into the Metasapiens line of fire, people. Luckily, she's a terrible shot. Let's go check her needs. I think she might need to... She's really tired now. And she's starving. Get closer. The more you can kill Metasapia, the better this is going to be for everyone. I know you're tired. Fire. Oh, not the solar panels. I'm assuming that people are going to come and put that out. And then I'm going to have to try and get power back to the base. Freezer's still frozen, so that's good. Alright, Vitamix and Ed, go and firefight, please. I've just lost a load of solar panels. might lose all of them but we'll just rebuild I'll um let the power back out of those in a minute oh, I can't believe this just getting somewhere with the the old food situation right Metasapia go and have a rest and maybe fight fires in the base and we'll get those two later But at the moment we've got like four big deer in there, which is brilliant. That should hopefully help us. Oh man, my solar paddles. It's one of those things, I guess. Right, uh, power. Solar, solar panel. Solar panel. Solar panel, solar panel, solar panel. Is the wall being built yet? No. Right, Ed. Work on that, please. Who is our cook? I bet it's Ed, isn't it? You watch. I need someone to butcher all these corpses as a priority, because that's going to give us loads of meat, hopefully. Ed is our cook. Right. Prioritize butchering. Someone else for Tomnix, maybe. Prioritize working on the wall. Tony, also prioritize. Where's the whole thing? That's annoying. But if that's the way it needs to be, that's the way it needs to be. Right, so Ed is carving up the first of our hunting 
thingies. And how much meat did we get from that? 39. Oh, that's all right. I think meat is fairly decent as well. I took 15 away. 15 and 39. Oh, that's all right. We might be okay for a bit. Well done, Metasapia. We can eat now. Everyone's eating. Yes. Who's starving now? Renard, Metasapia, Tony, and Itini. That might just buy us the time we need to let these guys grow. Because we're at like 25% odd, we're about a quarter of the way through. Um, I need someone to please flick the switch here. Because those are my backup batteries, which are for this exact situation. back on and power hopefully can draw off those batteries I miss Renard he's such a good builder hey, teeny um Eat. Oh no, he's actually alright for food. Shouldn't have told him to do that. So, how's the food situation? People are not doing too badly. Metasapia needs a bit of noms, I think. I'll tell her to consume a bit of venison as well, just as much as she needs. Okay, Ed. Tumnix, Renard, how are you doing health wise? Do you have any infections or anything? No, so you just need to recover from all of that. So that means I can use for Tumnix for working on the wall. going Ed, keep repairing these. And then who else will construct? Tony? Work on the solar panel. Work on the solar panel please. Renard is up, walking around. Good lad, Renard. Working on the wall, I think. Oh, he's broken. No, Renard. Why didn't you just rest in bed? You've got food now. Oh, you got fed and yeah, you got food. You're not very got much joy about you, unfortunately. I mean, we've got this joy room, but no one ever seems to use it. Well, at least it's only a soft break, not a berserk, horrible break. Um. Mood so down. Twenty three per cent. Ah, this psychic drone is so bad. But it's okay. It's okay. We can we can do this. Is 
Just need to get the food situation under control. And then in the next episode, I will send Metasapia out to get the drone. And hopefully she'll do a good job. But I just want to leave it for just another 5-10 minutes just to try and let the food situation even out. Frozen won't spoil. Good. Supposed to be making simple meals, but I don't know what whether venison just has to be eaten raw or what. Just leaving some meat on the floor for some nicks. I like your style. Oh, this place is such a mess. I need to do some hauling and cleaning and just everything, really. Oh, nice one for Tumnix. Yeah, get some growing going on in there. The batteries are draining at a steady rate, though. Nadi, you still broken? Yes. Which means that probably Ed needs to do the wall. Sorry, Ed. I know I'm relying on you a lot. You're my man. You're getting things done. We're not normally so good, but just these wounds need to heal and they'll be fine. They're all treated. I don't understand why you just didn't stay in bed. Would have been so much better. So we'll get the wall done. We'll get the solar panel done. As soon as the wall's done, that'll be the next priority. Just to get the power flowing back through, and then the other ones can be done um, a bit of a slower pace. Right, um, I do need you to do the other one. Just get things sealed up, because the last thing I need is a manhunter coming in here. Has a poor mood, Tony. Right, that's fine. She is stressed out. I mean, could she have some more joy hours? Maybe Would that help. Could everyone have a few more? Maybe like that. Teeny doesn't have any enforced um, hours at all. So I am thinking... It's sort of beyond these hours. I don't get the feeling that he was a night owl or something. Well, I'll, f I'll find out. I'll definitely find out. I'll do a few hours work here or there. People have got a lot of joy in their lives now, so hopefully that will help. Okay. Do you know what I would love to do? Is get people cleaning? Get people doing cool stuff? But no, we can't do that because everyone is just not doing what they're meant to be doing. Well, everyone's doing what they're meant to be doing. It's just everyone's just spending so much time sorting out the base that they're not having time to sort themselves out. They're not having time to do nice things like build walls and, and all that sort of thing. Not getting any time. Like, Vitamnix is spending so much time um, medicking that no research is getting done. It is bad, bad times. Let alone trying to haul the bodies from outside the base. Let alone building any defences against anything. Just trying to keep going, really. I wish Renard's wounds would heal.
I want to make this base really nice, but I don't have any time. I have one bar's worth of food in storage. Yes. You know how much of an improvement that actually is? Having one bar of food? How are these doing? Uh, 38%. Sort of halfway there. Still got some venison. People are trying to make it into food, which is awesome. Planting is going on, which is fantastic. Just gonna maybe speed this up a little bit. Just need you to to heal up a bit, Renard. That's all. Get rid of some of your wounds. Get everyone back to full health and eating properly and having medicine. What are we down to on the medicine? 71, so we're not doing too badly. Having lots of medicine is about the only thing that's kept us alive so far. I really want to pop at this ship, but I know I need to wait. We can still sort of. Uh... Renard has taken off all his clothes. Naked Renard. Just please don't leave the base. That's all I ask. Oh, we're gonna run out of power soon. Come on, Ed. Get that solar generator gone. What are you doing, mate? You're making food. That's great, but. Renard is fully healed. Yes. Cool. It's a shame we don't have another sniper rifle. But it means that he and Mendesabia can take it in turns on the ship. So with that, I am going to end the episode here. And I'm going to make him pick up all his stuff. Stupid Renard. Oh, I had better safety. Ah, oh, no, don't make you force wear all that stuff. I suppose you could, though. It was Renard that needs to have all this stuff. You need your hat back and your. and your armor vest. Uh, you got your armor vest on? Or actually the normal one would be better. Does anyone not have one? No, everyone does, so that's fine. So now the only person that is at all um, hurt is Tony. Everyone has had at least some food now. Um, Renard's a bit hungry. But there is food for Renard to eat. Might actually tell him to... Oh, he's going to eat that anyway. Poor mood, Renard. Okay, Renard, go eat your meal. And then you'll feel a lot better, I'm sure. Tired. Slept on the ground. Why did you do that? Where's your bed? Oh yes, Renard's off to bed. That's fine. He's sorting himself out. He's getting what he needs. And he'll get in a better mood then. He's just gone down to normal tired instead of very tired. So his mood is at 19%. So he... Oh, he could be at a mental break any time. I wish I could force him to have joy time. Maybe... I can work out what time it is. 4.50, right. So Renard is meant to be at 1600 working. 
then we could just uh, fill that in with some time for joy. Yeah. Go do some, some cool stuff, Renard. Please don't have a mental break. I'm trying to end the episode here. But I want to make sure everyone's kind of okay before I do. What's this? Oh. I don't really care if people can recruit Jebba or not. I'm just happy that there's meals. Oh, they are starting to run low though. Will these be done in time? Who knows? But at least they've all had a good feed. So, like, rather than being completely starving, they've all got relatively full food bars. So I'm not so worried. But having just one meal and four venison is not good. Mind you, we could send Metasapia up to get the other two if they're still around. No, they've gone. Oh no, they are still there. Right. So she could go hunting and try and get the other two. There's a bunny, some bunnies up there as well. Some silver too. Mm. Okay, I think that is definitely time for the end of the episode now though. Um, I think we are... See, I'm, I'm quite liking the look of my base now. It's starting to really come along. Just needs a bit of prettying up in some of the walls and things like that. But yeah, I'm kind of liking it now. Um, but yeah, we'll get the next episode, we'll get the power situation sorted. Um, because that's going to affect our food supplies quite drastically if we can't get it sorted. Luckily, we do have like a secondary um, power line in. So when the sun comes up, these power sources here should all help. Uh, these ones are disconnected, but at least we've got a few still sort of connected up. Um, so hopefully that will be a good backup. Um, what I really need to do though, I think, is to get a power station on the steam gazer as well. I think that will be a, a massive help. So I need to get someone to tunnel through to there. Possibly by putting... I don't really want to put a door in Tony's room, but I could do that if I needed to. Or we could just tunnel through and then seal it back up. But yes, that that's that's all for next time so we're just gonna end the episode here so if you liked it then please leave me a like in the comment section below and uh, if you want to follow the series a little bit more then please subscribe to the channel and let you know when new videos are going to be out and i hope to see you all next time but in the meantime please look after yourselves and keep being awesome